Hello and welcome. All right, we are in screensaver mode right now. So we just click on. What we want to know is how do we get the library widget back if it's gone? So I'll show you how, let's make it gone and then I'll bring it back. You basically want to get into edit mode on your home screen. And to do that, you can use your finger or you can use your pen. You hold, do a long press for three seconds. One, two, three. And can you see how it changes into this mode here? So you can tell you're in edit mode. You've got an uninstall badge up the top and you've also got settings, widgets and icon align. And these three dots show you, will show you the screens that are available to you. All right, you can add more screens with more apps on them, just like on your iPhone. All right, so just say we accidentally deleted that and then we tap off it. If you tap, it'll bring you out. So this is now, this is the same home screen, but my library icon widget is missing. So how do I get it back? All right, you do a long press, you get into edit mode, you come down here to widgets and you go, oh, the library, this is the one I want. I want the library. So this is the one I want. If you want the launch, then they're the formats. If you want search, that's the format. Quick switch. So you look for the one you want. I want the library and I want two or do you want four? Let's click on four. That's not the one I had. It's a lot bigger and that's why it's putting it on a different page. But I don't actually want that one, so I'm going to delete it. And back here on page one, you can see the black dot. So I had the two, the one that's got two on it. I'll show you. Library two. That's the one I had and it fits nicely. So I'm happy with that. Now I'm going to tap off. So you just tap anywhere on the screen and you can see that the library widget is back. That is how you put a widget on. Let's do one more. So let's go here. You can see I've inserted, so if I just, if I tap and hold, it's given me the option to remove it that way, which I could do, but I, I want to show you this way. So I'm going, whoa. I'm putting it in edit mode. You see how the icons have all come up? Let me just go back a page. So on this page, I'm not in edit mode. So let me just go back into edit mode. And you can see the, see the minus. That means I can delete that, which I will. If I wanted to delete any of these, I could just click on it and delete it. Right? I don't want I don't want to delete that one. So I'm going to go to widgets. I'm going to go. I'll show you what there is. Library, recent launch, launch, search, quick switch. Lock screen, notes, Onyx account, calendar memo, clock, music. And then if you've got apps downloaded that have got um, screen options, widget screen options, they will show up as well. So calendar, YouTube, Notion, I think that's, yeah, that's the end of my options. So I want to put the search, so I'm going to add the search here. And there was only one view that you can have, which is the one I've collected. I like that search, so that's really good. I'm going to leave that there. If I wanted something else, I could come down here. I don't want the lock screen. I've already got notes. I don't want my account. I don't want my clock. Oh, you might want your clock. If you clicked on the clock, you only get one clock. And then you could put another widget here if you wanted. Let's go down. Notes, we already have notes. I could put notes on that page, but recent favorites. Um, let me add a notion. Set up widget, I'm gonna go that one. And it's very big, which is why it has put it not here. So I don't actually want that widget then if it's that big so let's go back to that page i would like a widget to fit in here and the notion options so that was four by two if i use a two by two it's going to ask me which page do i want 
Let's just pick today for now. No, actually, I do love a task list. And it's, see, that's really cool. It's actually bringing data right now, which is fine. So it fits. Doesn't look great, but you know, it fits. Maybe if I get rid of the clock and then I realign the icons. Oh, oh no, I don't want it up there. Thing is, I don't think you can drag it. You can't. No, so I might delete that one um, and then just play around. So just play around and check what you would like. YouTube, calendar, Notion, music. That's pretty cool. Quick switch so you can get between all your recent apps. And the way you hop out of it is you just pull up from the bottom and it will bring you back out of edit mode and back out into your home drive. And you can see it's syncing right now because it had those two little, um, one's an up arrow and one's a down down arrow like that. Um, see, it's, see it's there again? Can you, oh, it's gone. Let's see. Will it come up again? Mm, yes, there it is. That just means it's syncing. Yeah, so that's how you can um, add and remove your library widget. Awesome. Any love on the channel is always appreciated. Bye.